bacteria aren't just single individual cells that, that you know, do whatever they do, make an infection or, or um, degrade a toxin or something like that. In fact, what they are is they're populations and communities of, of many, many cells. And so that can be true of just a single species of bacteria, or it can be true of a very diverse community. One of the things that, that we really don't understand about bacteria and microbes in general is the way in which they form these types of communities when you are dealing with more than one species. What we'd observed is you take two soil bacteria, one called uh, Streptomyces and the one called Bacillus subtilis, and when they were put together on a petri dish, what we'd observe is that the Bacillus subtilis would be uh, uh, lysed over a region of time, so that's where um, it would be actively degraded by the Streptomyces. And we were really interested in asking a couple of questions. One was, what causes that effect, and then how does it work? So what we're looking at here are two species of bacteria, Streptomyces, which is in this vertical line, and Bacillus, which is in this horizontal line. And what we're looking at, we see, is uh, actually this lysis in the uh, region towards the center of the plate where the, the two organisms are interacting with each other. And uh, this is in contrast to our mutant species of Bacillus subtilis, which has this drastically different morphology, and it's actually spreading out over the, uh, the whole petri dish. Bacteria can produce molecules that can block the growth of other organisms, including other bacteria. And those have been very useful to us because those have been sources of antibiotics. So many of the antibiotics that people use come from bacteria. And what we hope comes out of it eventually are identification of interesting new molecules, identification of bacterial um, mechanisms of control that one might exploit if you're trying to come up with a new antibiotic or trying to understand the way a community of bacteria forms.